So to change the pitch of uh, my drum when I'm playing, I'm using a very simple technique. I'm blowing some air into the snare drum with a pipe, or otherwise you can also inhale. So basically if you blow or if you are inhaling, you will change the tension of the drum head and that's why the pitch will be increasing. It doesn't matter if you are blowing or inhaling, the pitch will just go higher. So then if you want to play a role that begins at a, a high range and fall at the, at the normal pitch of your drums, you have to remember to blow first and then to begin the role while the drum um, is getting at its normal pitch again. Okay? So, you can use this technique for the snare drum, but you can also use this technique for the rack drum or floor drum. The only thing you need, in fact, is to have a, a hole uh, in the drum you want to use. If there is no hole, you will not be able to blow some air into the drum. So, then, just take a pipe that go so in the decompression hole of uh, your, your drum. So, for example, in my snare drum, I have this hole here, and uh, the pipe I'm using is going right into this hole. So then you just have to, uh, to take a pipe which is just a little bit bigger uh, than the hole of uh, your drum. And then you will just cut it a little bit to be sure it will, it will fit very easy. So you just cut a little bit uh, the pipe and it will fit very easily in uh, the decompression hole and uh, it will stay in place when you are blowing in it and uh, then just try this technique behind your drum kits and find, find some uh, cool pattern with it and um, for me it really opened a lot of possibilities and if you want to see this technique in a song you can watch my drum playthrough on sickdrummer.com of the song I Will Harm for my band Mitridatic.